Was this vapor pressure question one of the more easy or more difficult ones on the 2025 AP Chem? So in this question, I need to look at X versus Y and figure out which one has a higher vapor pressure. So if you're not sure what this means, vapor means gas, and then pressure is just the force that these molecules will exert on each other when they collide, when they become gaseous. So how do I know the answer? Well, the Lewis dot diagram, that's not really going to tell me the answer. Same thing with the molar mass. I have to look at the boiling point. I see that compound X boils at a lower temperature, so that means it becomes a gas more uh, first or before compound Y will. So therefore, uh, gas X or compound X, this one will have a higher vapor pressure. And I guess part of the reasoning is because, let's say if my temperature was 83, this has already become a gas. So compound X, it's already become gaseous and it's already started colliding with one another. So that'll give it a higher pressure, right? At 83 degrees, compound Y, this would still be a liquid. So that's how I would approach this question on the 2025 AP Chem. What did you think, what did you think of this one? Let me know in the comments. Thanks.